Hi guys, I've got a really cool mushroom to show you. If you've ever picked up an illustrated book on mushrooms or fungi, you've probably seen this particular mushroom and you've thought, wow, this is really cool. This is exotic. This is something that belongs in a rainforest. It isn't something that would possibly be in Michigan or Indiana, but indeed it is. And the issue with a lot of these photos in these field guides is they're of a perfect prime specimen and they don't show the degraded uh, morphology of a fruit bodied mushroom. In this particular instance, um, we actually found several stages of this fruiting body. Here's a young baby, which Dawn will blow pictures up and, and show you the mutation on it and the netting on it. I'll pick this one up and try to let Dawn get a slow image of the netting on top of that cap. This is called a wrinkled peach. You can see it has a white stipe and has a peach colored cap. And generally the gills on this are salmon pink to peach in color. Here's a good example. I like to turn the gills because it gives you kind of a flash of what's going on in the gills of a mushroom. But as this mushroom gets older, this reticulation that's on the cap or this netting that's on the cap kind of gets obscured and hard to see. And so people really don't see it because we're looking at a small mushroom and it likes rotting logs that are deep underneath nettles and a rich, moist woodland area. And so a lot of people just in Michigan and Indiana don't get the opportunity to see this. But it does have a peach to salmon pink cap with a white reticulated uh, netting structure on top. It has the same color gills. It has a white stipe. It's fibrous. Now this isn't considered an edible mushroom, but that doesn't change the fact that it is an extremely cool mushroom to find. And the current Latin name for this mushroom is Rhodotus palmatus. But the Latin name might change to Rhodotus reticeps, which I believe roughly translates to netted cap or reticulated cap. For now, Rhodotus palmatus, the wrinkled peach. I hope you guys get a chance to see this mushroom and experience it firsthand. Nothing unsafe about it, not toxic, not edible. See you in the next one.